Okay, so we're recording. Okay, so hi, I'm Mimi, and many of you may know that I'm a copywriter and that I became a copywriter after I finished my PhD from New York University. Um, but today I thought I would chat a little bit about the fuller story of how I got to where I am today. So it really starts um, quite a long time ago before I started my doctorate program. Um, so after I finished undergrad at Berkeley, I was really lucky and I was able to work part time on campus at my undergraduate job at the Student Learning Center. So shout out to the people who employed me because I am still extremely grateful for that time. Um, so when I was there, um, there was also this personal finance class that happened on campus. And so I found out where the lecture hall was and what times it met, and I sort of just snuck in. Um, and I learned a lot about managing money, like about debit cards versus credit cards and how to invest and like what retirement was. Um, I was 22, so I never thought about retirement before. Um... Yeah, so I learned a lot of really useful information about money management in this class. And like fast forward a few years and like being into my mid to late 20s, um, I was living in New York City doing my doctorate program and I realized that like how important that information was and how important it was that I had some basic understanding of managing money. Um, and I realized like it, it slowly, I became conscious that even in a city where women talk about, talk openly about having sex at brunch, um, they don't talk a lot about money. And so as I neared the end of my program, this kind of awareness grew and I eventually decided that I wanted to work more in this field. Um, so I went down the path, I finished my doctorate, I defended my dissertation, and then I went down the path of exploring my own personal finance business. Um, but the thing was that the thing I realized really quickly was that I don't have tons of expertise in personal finance. Like, yeah, I did this one class when I was 22, um, and I had my own experience, but my expertise was really in writing. Um, because I had studied literature in undergrad and in grad school. And so I kind of, I, I realized at one point that like writing was basically my, my, like my only skill, <laughs> my strongest skill, let's say. Um, so yeah, so then it kind of, it happened that I got this chance to write some copy for a friend. Um, and because I did that, I realized I could do it. And I started thinking about this copywriting world more, and I realized that I could actually combine my skill in writing with my interest in women and money um, by writing copy for heart-led, mostly female businesses, so that women have this copy that speaks to their ideal clients, so that they can reach the people they want to work with, close more sales, and grow their businesses. And like also experience financial sovereignty because all those things are related. <laughs> um, so that's kind of that's in a nutshell how I got to where I am, and also kind of in a nutshell where I am, what what I'm doing today in this copywriting. Um, yeah. So if you're looking for any copy and if that resonated with you, feel free to reach out and give me a call and we'll chat.